Sri Lankan President Gotabaya Rajpaksa dropped his brother as finance minister on Monday after calling for a unity government as protests against an economic crisis persisted and cracks emerged in the ruling coalition. The development came as the island nation is struggling to pay for imports of fuel and other goods due to a foreign exchange crisis. Sri Lankan President Gotabaya Rajapaksa in a statement on Monday called on for a unity government, urging all political parties to come together to accept ministerial portfolios to deal with the country's economic crisis after cabinet ministers and the central bank governor offered to resign. The development came after Rajapaksa declared a state of emergency on Friday, following protests over the economic hardship faced by the people of the country. Spontaneous street protests continued over the weekend despite a curfew. The debt-laden country is struggling to pay for imports of fuel and other goods due to a foreign exchange crisis, leading to hours-long power cuts and a shortage of essentials. In the latest, the president on Monday appointed Ali Sabri as the country's new finance minister and GL Paris as foreign minister. Leader of opposition Sajid Premadasa in an interview to news agency ANI said, we don't want a game of musical chairs where politicians exchange their positions. The whole country is calling for wholesale change, not tinkering with the existing system. So what we ask for is for path-breaking wholesale change that brings about relief to the country, not relief to politicians, not a game of musical chairs where politicians uh, exchange their positions. Prema Dasa also asked neighbouring India to help Sri Lanka to the maximum extent amid the crisis. The island nation of 22 million off India's southern tip is also grappling with soaring inflation after the government steeply devalued its currency last month ahead of talks with the International Monetary Fund for a loan programme.